Hello everyone, this is Cody Lee of BlackCatBooks.org, author of Eye of the Dragon, Cool and Beautiful, Rabbit Hole, King D.L., Lauren Frey, and the upcoming Mouth of the Dragon. Here I am with some more uh, F0X. I had a great day today, guys. <laughs> I got a little bit done on Eye of the Dragon, uh, Mouth of the Dragon. I got some, um, got some other things done, so got some books read, read some Hemingway, um, I didn't read any manga today. I finished Psyche K last night! Like, after I ended the stream, I ended up, like, finishing this fucking show... And I was getting excited for a season two, and then I realized there is no season two. Like, it just kind of ends. Like, what the fuck? I got... I thought there were two seasons. I, I was I was so angry. I was expecting a lot more, but... Oh, damn it. I'm going to have to learn Japanese. I'm going to have to read the manga. I'm going to have to import it and just... Uh, it, it's going to be a nightmare. I was a big fan. I was such a big fan. I'm so disappointed. All right. This is the most, like, disappointed I've been in, like, an ending of a series in forever. It's not even, like, the real ending. It's just the anime. The anime fucked me. Funimation fucked me. Netflix fucked me. Shonen Jump fucked me. It's just... Are you serious? Alright, here we go. Oops. Yeah, my lips are chapped, too. That's... They're getting worse and worse. It's not that cold, so I'm not sure what the, what the deal is with that. Oh, uh, here we go. I spent like three hours grinding in Legends Arceus trying to beat Giratina, and I still haven't done it yet. It's it's unbelievable how much I'm getting stomped by this fucking thing. I it has two forms. Like Pokemon has gone like full JRPG at this point, with like final bosses that have Pokemon that come out of nowhere, legendary Pokemon that come out of nowhere, and then like take on multiple forms <laughs> while you're fighting them. So it's legit really cool, but Oh, I haven't been able to beat it, because you have to beat, like, a, a full six-man team. It, it, it legit might be the best final boss in Pokemon history. They, they've really been stepping up their game. I thought Leon was good. Uh, but this is somehow, like, even better than that, with, like... Leon was, like, the ultimate six-man team guy, right? But then, like, Bolo whips out, like, a six-man team that I struggled to beat, whips out a Giratina, and then has it, like, change, change forms after you beat it once, which doesn't even make any sense, but it's, like... It's great. I, I really enjoy. It. I hope they. Uh, I hope they make more Pokemon games like this. I, I hope this is something they do. I hope they continue the Legends uh, line of games because I. I really enjoy them. I, I really enjoyed my time with this. This was. Uh, this was a phenomenal game. Game of the year for sure so far. Like I've only put like twenty six hours into it, but it, that was like a really fun twenty six hours. I think. I if I was younger, I would. I would put a lot more time into it. I think. Um, well. Actually, I would put more time into it now. It's just, um, you know, I'm working. Ugh. It, it's mostly his work. I haven't touched triangle strategy. I've been hyper triangle strategy, and I haven't found the time to touch it. Um, we might we might do that today, uh, probably. But I don't know. I, I really want to finish Legends Arceus. That, that's that's my thing right now. Is that Legends Arceus needs to get finished, and I need to move on to the next thing. I need to I need to finish Mario Odyssey. I need to finish like. Dragon Quest Builders, like, The Greatest Attorney, like, Silver Case, like, there's a lot of stuff I need to get through. Origami King, like, I, I am very behind on a lot of a lot of Switch games, so I really want to uh, to take the time to get through everything that I want to get through. Um, Sunblade Chronicles X I wanted to play again. Uh, I haven't touched that either. Like, it's getting really difficult to play RPGs. Like, I really do just want to come home a lot of times and just, you know, just play... F Zero X, like just play Pokemon Snap or whatever. Just work on a book or, or whatever. Like I, I, I was reading like before I went live. I, 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 uh, I have a uh, Hemingway in front of me, uh, The Sun Also Rises, which I, I, I think I've read enough of it at this point. Uh, I, I think it's about a cuck. I, I have no idea. It's like it's kind of it's kind of a confusing read. I think I'll have to, like, study it a little bit before I decide what to make about it, <laughs> what I think about it. It's, uh, never... I've read A Farewell to Arms. I liked A Farewell to Arms when I read that, um, but I don't think I like this as much. Here we go. So, yeah, I am, uh, I'm trying to find books for, like, the Black Cat Book Club. I, there's been nothing I've read in the past week that I want to, that I want to do. Like, I tried making one on, uh, Narnia... The magician's nephew, but I finished that a while ago, and I, I couldn't find anything interesting to say about it. 
So like I ended up doing Elric of Melibane, and I don't know, I'm not familiar enough with Elric to really make that video interesting. I basically just said I liked it. Like, um, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to read next. I, I probably should pick out something on the uh, on my Kindle. Um, Pendragon, maybe. I have a lot of stuff, like, on my backlog. Like, I have a I have a Cormoran Strike novel. The sixth one is coming out, and I haven't even read the fifth one yet. I, I got it in 2020. It came out in 2020, like, right after I started my new job. And I, I never read it. Like, I didn't have time, or I didn't take the time, I should say. I don't I have time to do stuff. I'm just, like, making excuses, honestly, it feels like. Um, I, need, I need to stop doing that. Like, I need to go to the gym. I need to, uh, I need to cook. I need to write. I need to, uh, I need to stream, honestly. Yeah, I made some, uh, I made some eggs today. And I, I used to not be good at it making eggs, but I, I guess I, I guess I'm good at it now. <laughs> so, yeah, I think I'm going to start, like, eating more eggs. They were actually pretty good. Yeah, the salmon I made some uh, last week was great. I, I think I'm getting better at cooking. Um, oh, shit. Seventh place? Oh, man, I wasn't paying attention. Thoughts on Russia invading Ukraine? I don't I don't have any thoughts on that. I'm not I'm not taking any sides. Which I guess means I support Russia, but... Mm. No, really, I, I don't I don't support either side. Like, Ukraine is uh, super corrupt, and uh, I, I know people who have been fleeing there for... It, it's a very poorly run country. So I don't... Um... I don't know. I don't think it's uh, it, it's America's business what other countries do, to be honest with you. So that I don't I don't care what happens in Russia, Ukraine. I don't want to... I don't want to give them money... I don't want our government to give them money, but uh, here we go. We'll get the third line of cars after we, uh, is Beastman on the, on the bottom row, or am I going to get him after? Oh, this game is so intense. Oh, come on. He just got in front of me. Black Shadow. You piece of shit. All right, get back here. I know this game so well I can call these, uh, drivers out by name. Uh, Black Shadow sucks if you actually try to use him. I, I've tried it before, and I, I don't know how you could possibly win with him. Uh, like, I think body is, like, the, the stat that I care about the least. I want good grip, and I want a good boost, but there we go. Got it. Hello. Cook some broccoli? Yeah, I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna get more... Yeah, broccoli is something I need to eat more of. I, I used to eat a lot of broccoli, but I, I haven't been getting any lately. Uh, I need to start putting it onto my, uh, my bio list. Oh, I should be playing the one by Nagoshi? Oh, no. Oh, no. Fuck off with that shit. Yeah, Nagoshi did work on GX, didn't he? That's uh, that's an interesting little tidbit. Yeah, I'm not a fan of GX at all. So I don't know. I've, I've seen like Monkey Ball fans suggest that like Super Monkey Ball One is the only good game he's ever made, and uh, I I don't think I disagree with that. Honestly, not really. Because like, Jackus is carried entirely by its story and presentation. It's not. It's not a very fun game, you know. I don't, I don't respect it at all as a video game franchise. Um, and it could have been great, I think. Um, 
but like it's just so repetitive. Not even like from game to game, they're just like in the game itself. It's like uh, so many cutscenes, like they don't the plots are just just stupid, like uh I'm not boosting enough. I really need to start boosting more. Oh, come on. Fourth place. Look at how many people died, though. Oof. Eight people. If they died, did they stay dead? I can never remember. This game is really good. Oh, yeah, for sure. For sure. This is a classic. Second place? Oh, shit. We gotta kill. Yeah, okay. We gotta beat Gazelle. The Mighty Gazelle. Come on, get over here, you. I think I got him. Okay, but... Yeah, it's actually a viable tactic. Just take out the guy ahead of you. Yep, I got him. Okay. Yeah, this game gets crazy hard in the higher setting. This is standard, and I'm struggling. So I'm going to have to, like, really step up my game if I'm going to be an expert or master. Which I have done. Um, like, my N64 cartridge can attest to that. But... Oops. Come on, come on, come on! Oh, 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 wait, oh, shit. I thought that was the last lap. Oh, fuck. Uh, that was uh, not the move I wanted to make. What I wanted to make. That's why you don't boost a lot, kids. Uh, I mean, this is part of what, the reason why this is such a great racing game, is that you have to really pay attention to stuff like that. Uh, Oh, fuck. He beat me. Okay. Hopefully that's not... He doesn't have enough points to uh, to take it back. I beat... Um, I beat the guy ahead of me. So I don't think that's a problem, but... Okay, there we go. Check that. Wow. Congratulations. Mario movie about to be overshadowed by the Sonic movie. Eh. I doubt that, but we'll see. I mean, it's an animated movie versus a live-action movie, right? So I don't think they'll be compared all that much. And the thing is, like, people are going to eat up the Sonic movie no matter what. And they're going to shit on the Mario movie no matter what. Like, the Mario movie isn't even out yet, and you have people bitching about the casting and just... Uh, with Sonic, like, everyone just ate that shit up. So, I, I don't know. Sonic fans have way lower standards than Mario fans do. So, like, Sonic Sonic might do better for that reason. But, like, Sonic's not going to make a comeback. I, I expect, like, once the movie franchise, like, tapers off, like, Sonic as a brand is going to be, like, dead in the water. Like, the comics are dead. The games are dead. Like, the cartoons are dead. Like, there's nothing. Yeah, the um, the PlayStation Direct was a complete joke. I I didn't make a video about it because it was so irrelevant. Like they're they're making like Dino Crisis knockoffs, Dino Crisis knockoffs now, and and just like 
releasing TMNT collections that, that are multi-plat, like, they're done. And, like, nobody really wants to admit it. Here we go. Okay. Oh, we got the Joker Cup. Excellent. Um, yeah, I think we're going to do Standard first, and then we're going to do Joker. Like, let's see. New City, figure eight. Fuck, Beastman is at the bottom. Okay, fuck. You don't know what you have until it's gone, huh? Uh, I like Beastman too much. I mean, I guess I could experiment. I don't want to experiment with another card and lose, though. That's the thing. So yeah, we're going to stick with the Blue Falcon until we get my preferred vehicle. I don't know, this is why I don't use like a lot of the cars, because like, I, I don't know if they suck or not. I, 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 the Blue Falcon's not my favorite, but I can win with it, so it's like... Eh. Plus, people like seeing it, you know? Like, it's an iconic design. I like seeing it, so... Oh, damn, seventh place? Oh, fuck, I gotta pick it up, gotta pick it up. Yeah, I need something with better grip, because I keep slipping. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Go, 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 go! Ridiculous. That was embarrassing. Fourth place in the first race? What am I doing? Well, I am playing on Expert, so I probably need to stop on my game, but... Yeah, yeah, I don't, I, I, I like, I, I thought Detective Pikachu was all right, right? I, I liked it, but I'm not going to see it again. I don't even own a physical copy, right? Like, I mostly just liked it because, like, oh, man, I never thought they'd uh, put Pokemon in live action. Like, it's not great. Like, the most memorable thing about the movie, and the reason I uh, want to see a sequel, was, like, the sheer amount of, like, Asian women that were in the theater. Like, I have never seen so many Asian women in one place. So I, I, uh, I, I really want a, another movie for that reason, but... Um, like, other than that, though, I'm like, yeah, I, I did a Pikachu, which is okay. I actually, like, think I, I, I think lowly of it, actually, because it could have been a lot better, uh, I think. And, and, um, it's not like what Sonic fans do with their, their constant, like, holy shit, like, Sonic is the, is the best video game licensed movie ever made. It, it's not. It obviously isn't, if you, if you know your, uh, video game licensed movies, but... Sonic fans just have low standards. That's all it comes down to. It's the only reason they thought like Sonic could ever compete with Mario. Because they have low standards. I can't compete on Expert! The game is too hard! Alright. Ah, damn it. Sixth place? Okay, I'm gonna have to experiment with a different... I thought I could win, but no. Uh, yeah, it looks like I'm gonna have to... Um, to either play more aggressively or just switch cars. Um, I'm going to take out everyone in front of me. See my rival. See, look. Look at how fast he goes. Like, look how they can just, like, accelerate. Yeah.
Bianca. Yeah, she's an expert, so. Yeah, I'm starting to struggle, I guess. Uh, it's been a while since I played on Expert, I think. So that'd be, that might be why I'm struggling. But, I mean, on Expert with a car I don't usually use, I would say. Because I could do with Beastman, no problem. But Yeah, I might not actually win the circuit this time. Right. Yeah, the Blue Falcon isn't cutting it. I need to, I need to upgrade. Yeah, he's in first again. Look, look at that. Baba's in first. Oh, yeah, in the higher difficulty settings, you're very lucky to get in, like... In the top five, it, it gets brutal. All right, let's see. Where are we? Okay, is it possible that I could come back from this? I think if I just kill Baba and just win, I, I should be fine. The best licensed video game movie will be the No More Heroes one by McKay. Yeah, probably. Assuming that ever comes out. Shit, I mean, I, I would want it, but yeah. I think I got him. Okay. I think I managed to salvage this run. Salvage this run. Okay. The thing is, when you're like focusing on targeting people, you're not you're not necessarily focused on winning. So it's hard to do both. Um, He's in the he's ahead of me? Shit. Shit, okay, we got in third. That's not the best position. Uh, but we took out like the guy immediately in first place, so I think we can do that again. Uh, we might be in the clear. I probably went up a spot. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so yeah, I think yeah, once I take out Billy once, that should do it. So we have two races to do that. Alright. Discord, yeah I do. I was thinking of, like, uh, posting it on YouTube again, on the community tab. Aw, oh, damn, this is going to be a difficult one. It's hard to, like, uh, knock people off here. Twenty-six split. All right, and without the boost, you can't get ahead. All right. I keep swerving around. I don't remember where all the boosts are because I haven't been, I haven't played this game in a while. Uh, Shit. 
Yeah, the momentum really just, uh, I hate it when that happens. Like, you're, you have to go fast in order to compete, but yeah, you can be thrown off if you're not careful. And I was careful, but I still got thrown off. Look at this, I've been dead last. Yeah, I'm gonna have to like upgrade my my game because I'm I'm just not I'm just not feeling it. I just can't do it. Right, here we go. I don't have the skill. All right, it's gonna take some practice, I think. So expert, I got filtered by expert, and I think there's a higher difficulty o over this too, master. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have to get a better car, something with more of a boost to it. Fourteenth place is better, I think, than I what, what I what, where I was. And what you should do is that you should be boosting in between like uh, the boost pads, but because I'm not hitting the boost pads at all because I suck. Uh, here you go. This one up here. Get my shit mistake. Ridiculous! And Baba, Baba might have more points than I do, even though I took him out last last race. Let's see, let's see if I lost a space. Probably, right? Yep, down. Yep, look at that. He actually made a comeback. Yeah, unless I take out Billy, I'm, I'm not gonna win. And I have to like finish higher too. Well, I think this might be a, an easier race, so it's. See how this goes. Shit. I'm not even boosting yet. I'm already twenty third. Right. Oh, packed in here. Shit. Get in and get my speed going. I need, I need to go a little bit slower. All right. Shit, they got... How'd they all get ahead of me? All right. There they, there they go. I got you in my sights. All right. He's going so fast, I can't even catch up. All right. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> it was right there, and I failed. Ah, oh, come on. See, I need to tweak my settings. This game might take a while, a lot longer than I thought it would to get through. I didn't think I would uh, struggle this much to uh, to beat it, especially on expert. Like maybe master, but yeah, I didn't really realize that Beastman was on the uh, the bottom row. So I'm gonna have to unlock him. That's gonna take a lot of grinding. I'm gonna have to find a different vehicle because like uh, the problem is that the, the Blue Falcon just can't keep up. Like with my playstyle, I just um... yeah, I have to find someone better. That's how more suited my needs. Yeah, some of the better grip, probably.
Six. There we go. Why do all these people constantly troll you? Uh, I don't know. I, uh, I'm not sure. I'd say it's because of, uh, I like Nintendo games, but... I think that's really all it is, honestly. Ah, damn, my lips. That chapstick cannot get here soon enough. I wish I had some lying around, honestly, but... It looks like it's getting worse. Yeah, we're gonna have to get a better car. Yeah, we're gonna have to experiment a little bit. Fourth place. Not even in the top three, embarrassing. Okay, so let's look at uh, boost A. Lots of boost A's. Yeah, let's try the Blood Falcon. I uh, don't think I've ever seriously tried. I think this is a rec world record holder. I think I've seen it used competitively. I think so. Let's see how this goes. Oh yeah, I like that a lot. Oh, that feels good. I think I'm going to stick with the Blood Falcon going forward. It doesn't have great grip, but I don't think that's going to matter on the Jack Cut. Who knows? Yeah, because I just need, like, to go feel fast in the straightaways. I need a good boost, basically. Who knows? Yeah, the grip is shit. Yeah, yeah. Lots of big YouTubers. Let's see if this works. All right. Well, I think like I think those big channels get big because they're uh, they're drama channels primarily. They don't have like real interests or hobbies or even real careers. They just attack other people on the internet for for donations. That's what it comes down to. I I was really surprised when, like, I was watching Kino Casino tonight, and, like, they were going over a bunch of e-celebs, e like, people like Beardson, people like Boogie. I I was really surprised how common it is for live streamers today to just tell their audience, give me money. Like, every single time. Like, I saw a clip of Beardson just screaming at his audience, like, why, it's 9 a.m. Like, why are you not giving me money? Like, it's Friday. Like, it's payday. Where, where, where's my, where, where's my money? And it was, it was so weird to me seeing this because like I'm so vocally opposed to grifters, and but I, I don't watch grifters in action usually. It, it not usually, and like seeing it today, it, it's weird.
Like, why is anyone giving these people money? I don't understand it. Okay, fourth. That's not bad. That's going to take a lot of practice, I think. Yeah, I'm fifth. Michael Shane. Black guy's a prisoner? Isn't that, isn't that racist? I remember looking at the guide for this game. It, it's weird how much I remember about the the factoids about the, the characters in the guide that came with the game. Not the not the uh, the player's guide, the, the manual. Like I remember looking through it and thinking it was awesome. Just like the backgrounds of the characters. Yeah, it's stuck with me even now. I, I think it's a big reason why. I, I hate GX, because GX does not make these characters look cool at all. Like, it doesn't. It, it fails. What was that? I somehow got flipped over. Rifters are just evolved anti-work guys. Hmm. I guess. I don't know, man. There are a lot of people in the uh, anti-work sphere, so I'm. I don't. Know, I was. I was thinking like I, I'm coming on stream talking about like how I hate, uh, how I don't like working, and how I want to get out of it. Does that make me anti-work? And the answer I think is no, because like I've taken like my my uh, my work life and really done a lot with it, with my money, with like uh, starting my own business, like doing what, investing, doing what you're supposed to do, right? I don't see that coming from the anti-work crowd. I don't like they're not doing anything to improve their situation. Um, like, they just blame, like, um, their employer all the time for everything. And, like, I really have no problems with my employer at all. Uh, if anything, they're probably the best employer I'll ever have, but um, not that it's saying much, but... I don't, it's really funny to me, like, seeing people, like, make these obviously, like, fake, exaggerated, like, uh, anti-work stories on, on the subreddit, and, and, and just, like, me thinking to myself, like, wow, I, my life was worse than this at one point, and yet somehow I, I have, like, everything I need to succeed now. And that's what it comes down to, is that they're not, they're not like, figuring things out. They're, they're not trying to. They just want to bitch. And that's why you can't take it se take them seriously. I think that's what it comes down to is that like I don't like all you have to do is work like and that's it. So like I think I don't know. I think we're getting to the point where like employers are having trouble like finding people though, because like. I noticed, like, when I left uh, the last job, that, like, they weren't going to have anyone, like, replace me. They were having problems finding people. Like, uh, they were just, like, we were being, um, so I, I think when I left, they, they probably, they were struggling for a long time trying to find someone to replace me. And, um, you know, I never once considered, like, staying, you know, in the long term, because it was so terrible. Uh, I think a lot of people in that position, where they'll just, like, get to where they need and just kind of stay there. Uh, now I'm like looking into starting my own business and uh, getting away from all that. 
Well, looking into, like, I have been running my own business. It, it just, it's just, um, it's going to take a while to get to where I need to be. Like, I'd like to be making six figures, like, annually before I even consider, like, leaving a job. And that's not going to happen anytime soon, I think. Hmm. Yeah, I think, I think I need better grip. I don't think the boost is worth, worth like, the loss of, um, of grip. Look at that. He's more than 100 points ahead of me. Yeah, I should probably just stop right here but and, uh, and choose another character, but I think we're going to keep going through it. We're going to keep uh, trucking. I don't know. Like People are always like comparing their living situations to like millionaires and billionaires, and I'm just like, bro, just, just figure out what you need now, you know, like, and then just gradually work your way up there. It's not... It's not complex, you know? Like, there are always things you can do to improve your late situation, and just, they don't, they don't even try. Oh, I can't feed my baby. Why, why'd you have a baby? <laughs> like, th things like that. Oh, I can't pay for my car. Well, why did you buy the car? Like, it, it's like, what, what are you, what are you doing? Like, you're just, I can't pay my student loans. Why do you take the student loans? It's like, you're making obvious mistakes, and you're not, like, really, really uh, uh, owning up to it, you know? Yeah, I hate anti-work people, so I don't, I don't really identify with them at all. Because, like, um, what I'm doing, like, with the business, that takes work, right? Like, I have to manage things. I have to promote my content. I have to... Uh, I have to write the books, right? And uh, I'm trying to do, I want to get to the point where I'm putting out like three or four a year. I do. Um, like, I think I might be able to manage uh, two this year. I think the way things are looking now, Mouth of the Dragon is gonna get done this year. Uh, and I think, I'll, I think I'm gonna like edit Dearly Beloved and like release it early next year. And then like write something else and release it at the end of that year. So I think I'm working to the point where like I'll have uh, two a year. And then like, I'd like to, I'd like to get up to three or four. I think that's the goal right now. What the fuck? Yeah, I can't. I can't do the cylinder. I'm I'm sucking at the cylinder. Always avoid loans for sure. For sure. I don't. I don't think at this point. I don't think I'll take a loan out ever. Um, I have everything paid for. Like I I I could buy a Tesla with loans. Not not gonna happen. Um. Like, that's a bad financial decision. So uh, I'm not going to do it. So. Like, that's all you have to do is just don't buy stupid shit you don't need. And uh, most people just spend their money as soon as they get it, I feel like. I mean, I have relatives who, uh, who vacation several times a year. Uh, my parents do that. And somehow they turn around and say they don't have money. Like, it happens all the time. Yeah, I, I think all people need to, like, to do to deal with, like, uh, the change in uh, culture going forward is they need to stop moving out at, at such a young age and just save up money for, like, a down payment on a house. That's it. That, that's all you have to do. Like, everything else is just kind of... Everything else you do, like, with the bad car decisions and, like, the student loans, it's all because of that, like, moving out too early. Like, you just need to stop doing that, uh, I think. That, that's really all you need to do. And if your parents can't t tell you you can't do that, fuck them. Tell them to go fuck themselves. Um... I can't afford a new computer. I can't afford a new new computer. What are you talking about? I am getting it this year. I'm just not getting it now. 
Because I have other things I need. I'm trying to um, investments. Uh, th that's that's the main thing that's getting me right now is that like I really need to like start. Uh, I really have been saving up for retirement. I've saved like several thousand dollars uh, this year alone, and like I have. Uh, it is starting to to accumulate and like stuff like that. Uh, but I, I I always need more, and I do want to like increase my contributions. So like even like when I get raises, even when like I get born free money. Like book money, when I get like AdSense money, like it, it all just goes into that. Like I don't, I don't spend it on frivolous stuff, ever. Wait, was that a lower? That was a lower percentage. That was lower than I got with uh, Captain Falcon. Okay, wow. Oh no, it's Alex responded to you in a stream. Oh yeah, of course he is, because he's obsessed. He's he's obsessed. I um, I considered. Like I was, I was aware of that. Like someone notified me when it happened. I was considering like doing a response to it. I, I'm not sure I will at this point, because uh, because why would I? You know, like I was right. The Steam Deck isn't particularly popular. Uh, it's not going to replace the Switch, and, uh, you know, the, the people on my Discord trying to convince me that it's running uh, Switch games are, are coping, essentially. Here we go. Yeah, I should probably turn my acceleration back up. I think I'm just a little bit too light on that. This isn't high speed, but I'm somehow like hitting high speeds anyway. Yeah, you can do crazy shit on these horses if you just boost constantly. Okay, I think this is what I can. Yes, we did it! Oh, finally. But yeah, responding to people like, oh no, it's Alex, would be like a waste of my time, honestly. Like, it, it does kind of feel that way, is that like, he, he's a nobody. He has like 20,000 subs. Uh, he's a drama channel, like, why, why would I respond to something like that? Like, he's just trying to get like, a response out of fanboys. Oh, well, to get a response out of like, um, gamers. I, I said fanboys, I don't think that's correct. Because like, when I, when I launched that video uh, that, I, that I saw, where he's like talking about like Nintendo fanboys freaking out over the Switch, uh, the Steam Deck. It, it's like it's people like um, you know normal people like uh, um, uh, the Emperor, right? Like responding to these ridiculous allegations that uh, the Steam Deck is going to replace the Switch, right? Like it, it's just him. Like he it, he basically just releases a tweet saying that like it's not going to happen, and like oh no, it's Alex tries to make it look like he's like a delusional fanboy or some shit. It's it's ridiculous. It makes no, it's it's pathetic. And then like he tried coming after me like hardcore, like trying to get another response out of me after I made my response video, and it's just ugh. I don't know. Like after after VGL fifty eight, I don't I don't think I want to engage with these people anymore. Um, because why would I? Like I I have better things to do. I, I could actually play and enjoy my games for one thing. Like I, I think that says that speaks volumes. Like. Instead of like actually playing their games on, on the Steam Deck, 
uh, Valve drones are like are like making uh, streams about Nintendo fans. Like that's that's what they're thinking about is like Nintendo Nintendo people enjoying their switches. Like, they're not actually playing their Steam Deck. Um, one of the reasons I don't do podcasts is because, like, I'd rather be playing games. And I can kind of talk about the stuff I want to talk about, like, during a Black Cat show, during, like, a gameplay stream. Like, I, I don't see those people doing that. They're not, like, sh they're not playing their Steam Decks. They're, they're telling you that, 